when Zay crossed that, that painted grass now. Yeah, exactly. When, when he crossed it, I told him I loved him. He deserved it. So I'm now happy for him. Jaha was mentioning too that there's been some guys that have been on the scout team that got reps today. How yeah. cool is to see that, you know, some guys mm -hmm. all get reps and be able to play? Exactly. I mean, without the scout team, we're not. That's, that's the truth. I mean, they grind each and every day just like us, and they don't really get the opportunity to showcase their talent. So just coming for a game like this, I mean, we appreciate it all week for them to come in, and, and we were all excited when we all saw them. I guess moving forward, what's it going to take now? You guys got one last FCC road trip to yeah. come and uh, just kind of keep that Bama standard going. Exactly. I mean, it's a one and no mindset. We just got to do it, preach it, and you know, y'all y'all see at the end of, end of this show we're capable of doing. Defensively, was there any type of, was there any, uh, expression from Coach Kane after the touchdown? Was the Coach Womack, did he have any type of expression, any type of excitement after the touchdown? The side of I mean, yeah. I, what was it, our first defensive touchdown, right? Yeah. I mean, of course. I mean, that's the first touchdown on defense. And I mean, we got to get more. You guys have been able to force a lot of turnovers here. What, I think three in the last four games each. Mm -hmm. Just how important is that and how much do you guys just kind of preach that each and every week? And take yeah, I mean, again, that's a Swarm D mentality is get turnovers. And we do it in practice and we do it again. I mean, I'm not going to speak on the conference. I mean, I'm just glad I came to the SEC. What did you see on the play when you got your hands on the ball and forced it out? Yeah, I mean, it was a corner blitz. I knew I was coming, so I see him turn the corner. I'm, I'll hock down anybody, so I see an opportunity. I punched at the ball and got it out. Think of Xavier and his fumble return and touchdown. Again, as soon as he crossed the goal line, I, I told him I love him. Happy for him. He deserves it. How do you think the defense has just kind of continually trended up with the way you guys have played since the Vanderbilt game? I mean, I, I'll say, I mean, it's just a swarm D mentality. It's just dominate the person in front of you and just do it down in, down in, and do it over and over till they quit. It seems like a lot of you guys, though, it's not just like one guy that are able to force those turnovers. Mm -hmm. How good is that to see kind of everybody eat? Exactly. I mean, that's why you have 11 people out there because each person can make a play. So I mean, I'm happy they're all doing it. You see what happens when we all do our job down in and down out we create turnovers. One guy in particular that's played well of late is Jahai. Just what has he meant to this defense in the middle? I mean, he's a baller. He's a dog. He's everything above. I mean, he's just a great, great person, great leader. Great person. You guys were able to get a lot of those young DBs in the game. What yeah. did you think of the way they played? I mean, they, they played well. I mean, besides me and Seven, we're the only upperclassmen in the room. So, I mean, we've been doing it all year. So, I mean, they, just, they deserve it. How big was it to get that defensive touchdown off your back and, and get one in the, in the tally? Say again. How, how big was it to, to tally one of those uh, defensive touchdowns? Get get that off your back where you didn't have one all season. Yeah, exactly. And that's what we were preaching all week. Get a defensive turnover and score. I mean, we did that. Quay was saying that there was a little bit of a competition. When did you? You're, you're a guy that maybe a lot of people thought would have gotten it. Just uh, uh, what was that competition like? And what did Xavier uh, say after he scored? No, I just told Xavier I love him and he deserves it. So, I mean, it's always a competition, but Xavier got it.